What are pores? Pores are small openings or holes in our skin with a diameter of 0.02 millimeters to 0.55 millimeters. Our face alone has some 20,000 pores. Can you believe it? It's those pores where oil is released. Residues piling up from too much oil or makeup sticking onto the pores or old skin cells make it difficult for the oil to be released and thus make pores get larger. Also, due to aging skin, pores lose elasticity, which again leads to enlarged pores. That's why it's important to start caring for your pores as soon as you can before it's too late. What's the function of sebum? The sebaceous membrane that forms on the surface of the skin is slightly acidic and creates a protective layer on the skin surface through which germs are stopped from developing and moisture doesn't evaporate. If the acidic level gets high, the sebaceous membrane loses its protectiveness from external irritation and recovers its acidity by releasing sebum. Excessive sebum makes the skin look oily, but can also cover pores, which is why an appropriate balance of oil and moisture is needed. Oily skin. On oily skin, pores usually stick out to the eye, and as excessive amounts of sebum is released, the skin becomes oily. People with oily skin types usually have excessive sebum on the entire face, but especially on the forehead, nose, and chin, so the T-zone. But as people with oily skin also have radiant skin and elasticity, the good thing is that their skin does not age easily. It's good to get rid of residues that are deep inside the pores through deep cleansing around once or twice a week.